It's that video that's impossible to forget. 22-year-old Carlisha Freeland Gaither being snatched off the streets of Philadelphia. She screamed. She fought. She even kicked out one of her attacker's car windows. But she couldn't get away. However, Wednesday night, Carlisha's mother got the phone call her family had been waiting for. She was very upset. She was crying. And she just was asking for me. Tell me she loved me. She missed me. Come get her. Federal agents used surveillance video and a GPS on the suspect, Delvin Barnes' car, to track him down. Police found the 37-year-old in a parking lot in Maryland Wednesday night. Carlicia was in the back seat, unharmed. Now that she's safe at home and Barnes is behind bars, it's obvious, had authorities not acted quickly, this could have ended very differently. Well, we don't know what his plans were, but based on information from Virginia, with the previous case that he's involved in, it probably was not going to be a very good outcome. Yeah, Barnes is actually being held on charges related to a separate case involving the abduction of a 16-year-old girl in Virginia and has yet to be charged in the Pennsylvania case. But even the guy's uncle wasn't exactly shocked when he heard the news. This is how me to the viciousness of it. So this got us thinking. What should someone do if they find themselves in a similar situation? Be aware of your surroundings and one of the most important things. Here's a few tips that could potentially save your life or that of your loved ones. You gotta be cognizant of what's going on. So if I go to grab here, she's gonna do a nice groin smack. Boom! Opposite hand, I, and she's out. I go to grab her. So I go to grab, straight through the eye, ah, through the groin, and again, she's out. Hey, in self-defense, just like life, by failing to prepare, you are preparing to fail.